You already know what it is. It's your boy Laid Back with another reaction, another review, another episode. Hey, Noose Top 5. You up to bat. Bitch, I'm drowning up in it. Most of you niggas is lazy. Half of you niggas full gazy. Yeah, I be spitting that crack shit. Cause I was born in the A. It's your boy Laid Back. Welcome back to my channel. Hey, two things we gotta do. You gotta hit that subscribe button. I'm drinking this water. You already know what it is, man. Appreciate time. Appreciate life in 2021, man. Make sure you hit the like button. Make sure you hit the notification bell. Stay up to date with all the videos. You see, we back with another Nukes Top 5, man. Y'all wanted it. I'm giving it to you. This is five ghosts that scared ghost hunters. So make sure y'all drop with you in the comments. Let me know that y'all with me. You know what I'm saying? And the real ones stick around to the end. You know. So if you a real one, you know, you know what's up. But uh, yeah, Fire Squad, what's poppin'? Let's get it. Top five ghosts caught on camera. Behind your back. YouTube ghost hunters Honex TV are investigating the abandoned Lord Line building in the English port city of Hull. Previous visitors claim to have seen a dark ghostly figure roaming the halls of the old building. As I was talking, where are you kind of thing? And, I, and as soon as I picked up male and female, I heard running. And it was literally like, it was like proper footsteps about eight times. And it felt like they were getting faster. And then I seen the shadow there of a male. And then all of a sudden, I had to say, stop, whoa, because it was getting faster and faster and faster. What did you hear then? I heard someone running down that corridor. Yeah. Yeah. That's what exactly what it was like, running. Unfortunately, they didn't catch this encounter on video. However, later, as they are discussing the incident, this happens. To be honest, all I saw was the face. And I didn't see any body, I didn't see any hair. It was literally just the face of a white lad. I put him early to mid 40s, really thin. That's what I've seen, really thin guy. Oh, but longer, kind of dark the hair. Years, the amount, you're used to that. You the looked, years, you yeah. looked um, I'm not used to them running at me all the while, though. Yeah, but you were used to seeing them like that. Oh, yeah, seeing them. Seen. Looked, um, I'm not used to them running at me all the while, though. Yeah, but you were used to seeing them like that. Oh, yeah, seeing them's fine. Running at me all the while, though. Yeah, but you were used to seeing them. Oh, yes. Somebody was just As they are talking, the team doesn't even notice that a shadowy hunched over figure seems to quickly run toward them and then rush away. So did they capture footage of the mysterious shadow figure of Lord Lyne? Let me know what you think. For more Hauntex ghost investigations, be sure to check out their YouTube channel, Hauntex TV. I don't know about that one. Behind Closed Doors. Over on the popular Pakistani ghost hunting channel, Wokia Ta, the team investigates a farmhouse that is allegedly haunted by a spirit or demon. While investigating, they begin to hear an odd sound coming from inside one of the empty rooms. One of the explorers claims he saw something lurking in the corner of the room. When they check his phone footage, this. Gathering their courage, they head into the room to investigate. 
भी नहीं है यार इसे मैं बैठी हुई थी बिल्कुल इस जगह पे छोटा सा था उसका कद यार ऐसे ऐसे नीचे बैठी हो ना Something seems to try to lock them inside What? the room, and then things really get weird. Is this shit fake? No, no, no. Why you trying to be a cat? 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 Something violently shoves open the door, slamming right into the investigator's arm. Later, when they watch their footage of the incident back, they find something that chills them. So, did the Wokia Ta team catch a real ghost or demon on camera, or is it all just an elaborate hoax? You decide. You can watch Wokia Ta's full investigation of the haunted farmhouse over on their channel. No. I'm Ten not. years of fear. Ten YouTuber years. Mellowbird says that he lives in a very actively haunted house. He's been posting videos of bizarre poltergeist activity in his home for over ten years. Ten in years. In fact, his oldest videos were probably some of the first paranormal videos I ever watched on YouTube. Ten years. Now, in this video, Mellowbird says that he had been hearing strange sounds and experiencing unexplained activity in his house's attic. A lot of banging noises going on in the. Uh, I'll take a little bit of the like this. So, see. So I'm gonna come up. See what I can see. So he set up a night vision camera. To record. Then one day, he says he heard creepy noises coming from the attic. Melbourne went up to investigate, and it didn't go well. I don't like the stuff's moving around me in the dark. After some jolting, unexplained bang causes the whole attic to shake, Mellow Bird decides to just get out of there. Ten years old. You gotta get the fuck out of there, buddy. What the heck? What the fuck? I'm not doing like that. <sighs> Check out Mellow Bird's YouTube channel for more of his videos of paranormal activity and poltergeist encounters. Oh, cool. Missing 411. YouTuber Franco TV is checking out an abandoned ghost town in the Smoky Mountains. In the middle of a forest, on the side of a mountain. He finds an old abandoned church. Oh, this is what I found here. Look at this. 
This is a random church here in the, woods. In the Smoky Mountains. And there doesn't seem to be any signs of anyone. What's in here? There's a bell here. I'm not gonna ring the bell. Oh my God. So this is a church. Not for me, buddy. All out of wood. This is amazing. Franco goes on to explore the abandoned town through the night, what? checking out the empty, decaying houses. And even though he's miles out into the middle of nowhere, it seems like he might not be alone. Hey, I'm just exploring. Hello. Yo, hello. Huh. So this place has been sitting here for quite some time. So I'm thinking the noises that I'm hearing is this building settling in. I don't think it's anything weird because it's an old Yo, building. Yo, he, he out here in the middle of the dark like this? On some regular so, shit. You guys, uh, this is regular. That. All I know is that in this place. Hello? Hello? Frank decides to exit the house and heads back to the church where he started. And that's when things get truly bizarre. In the of the night? Alright. Just trying to keep a lookout for bears. I made it back to the old church. Each God, this thing is huge. What the f*** is that? got something on I saw something like a black shadow I literally just saw like a black shadow he about to go in there holy crap Franco spots a creepy black figure through the window, but when he looks closer, nothing there. So did Frank spot a vagrant? Was it another explorer who hid or ran away? Or something supernatural? Let me know what you think. You can watch Frank's full series of this investigation over on his channel, Franco TV. Gatekeeper. Welcome back to Visually Creep TV. Oh, no. On the channel Visually Creep TV, a guy named Justin explores allegedly haunted places and locations. After his many investigations, he believes that something might have followed him home from one of his recent explorations in a cemetery. He and his wife begin to hear unexplained footsteps at night and the sound of doors opening and closing throughout the house. What? He also started to get nightly alerts from his motion-activated security cameras. Then one day, 
Justin wakes up from a nap to some very strange noises. I was taking a nap downstairs. My son's sleeping upstairs right now, but I woke up a couple times with what sounded like metal clinging together after I fell back asleep. Um, I heard something slam. Uh, I'm pretty sure it was a baby gate. So I'm gonna uh, attempt to use my spirit box in here because I'm damn sure that's what it was. I don't know if that's what it was. And that just closed. That just shut. That just shut. Holy That just shut. I caught that. I got that on film, dude. I got, I think I got that on film. He said I think now. He tripped. I'm gonna open it. Are you angry? I know there's some in here now, man. Did you follow me from somewhere? I just, I'm pretty sure you slammed it on me when I wasn't looking. Can you close the gate for me one more time, please? Are you good? Can you close the gate? Oh, oh, oh my God, dude. <laughs> that is not cool. So could this just be heating or wind blowing the gate shut? Could it be a supernatural presence? Or is it just a hoax? You decide. All right, so that was five ghosts that scared ghost hunters. That was kind of creepy. Some of it be a mix though, like, is that bullshit or is that real? But I feel like I'm building up my tolerance uh, for the real ones. Thank y'all for sticking around to the end. We made it. <sighs> Till next time though, man, self-love and positivity for our squad. I got you when you know it. Hey.